bro! <laughs> Woo, I'm excited about today. All right, what's up, guys? And welcome back to some more Modern Warfare 3. You know, a lot of people might hate this bunny skin, but this is my skin. I've claimed this skin. I like this skin. Look at my carrots. So today we're gonna be unlocking priceless camo. So as you guys can see, we're currently 33 out of 36 weapons forged camo, which after we complete this, we'll unlock priceless. And then we gotta do it 36 more times to unlock interstellar. So we need 11 one shot, one kills while ADSing. We have to get six more kills without an enemy damaging us with the Karambit. And to round it all off, we have the cat AMR, which we have to get four more penetration kills with this sniper. Similar with the grenade launcher, I've heard this challenge has had mixed opinions some people find it pretty easily some people find it pretty challenging i myself i've been in both at the beginning it sucked but then i found a method so yeah let's uh hop into some terminal 24 7 and unlock some camos i know i've said this in the last couple videos but i really do want to say thank you for all love and support on the channel recently we've been changing it up a little bit of things on the channel longer videos a little bit more consistency and overall modern warfare 3 has surprisingly been fun although i don't agree with the price point and it quite literally is a dlc to modern warfare 2 the game is really really good definitely one of the better call of duties that we've had in the last couple of years but if you've been enjoying the content find yourself coming back subscribe it's absolutely free and drop a like oh and real quick i just want to let you guys know about G Fuel's buy one get one Black Friday sale happening right now until the 27th. G Fuel was the first sponsor of my entire channel. It's led to us having our very own custom Dismo Shaker Cup, which you can actually use code Dismo on or anybody's code and cop one with the link down in the description. Like I said, there's a BOGO deal happening right now. It's a great time to restock, whether it be these tubs for the powder or the cans, which are just quick and easy to pop open and start to drink. Like I said, there's gonna be a link down in the description. Buy one, get one. If something's not on sale you guys can use my code or many other people's for like a 20 percent discount and uh yeah let's jump into this video 11 one shot one kills i got slugs on the shotgun it should be easy it's basically a sniper i will say this the mastery camo grind is basically done at this point i've looked at some of the challenges for the priceless camo and like they're stupid easy the hard part of the grind is quite literally what it's been every single year leveling up the weapons getting it to like platinum or like forged camo after that the challenges actually become pretty easy so now that the interstellar camo grind is almost done quite literally it is done. how did i get a hit marker peek me that big bodybuilder better peek me i'm not leaving my sight i'm just adsing the entire time does it hello did granny two cheese get him oh my god he's dead on the ground right there <laughs> So now that the interstellar grind is basically over, and you might be asking, Dismo, you haven't even unlocked Priceless Light. You're quite literally halfway done. That's what I thought too. I was doing a little bit of research and like looking into... I pulled my trigger first. I went ahead and I looked at some of the challenges for Priceless Camo. I'm not even joking. The challenges for Priceless Camo are easier than some of just the normal base challenges. Missed. Hit mark. Okay. Not gonna... Maybe I should have just gone to hardcore, dude. Why do I always make it more difficult? After leveling up every single weapon and getting everything pretty much forged, I can confidently say that... What do I have on this gun that's making it weak as shit, dude? Something is doing something. You know what? I don't like slugs at all we're just not gonna use them so prior to mod one for three coming out in my opinion the easiest mastery camo grind in call of duty history was orion camo it just really was the easiest and i didn't think that it could actually get topped especially the fact that the oh my god oh my god oh my god Oh, I just, no, you can just stay alive. What is, are they just, they're just with me, right? The Orion Camel Grind was just basically easy. When they added new DLC weapons, you could quite literally skip like the knife, the launchers, the riot shield, all the normal like annoying weapons that a lot of people just wouldn't want to use. You can skip them. And that's what made the Modern Warfare 2 Mastery Grind so easy. Can I quit getting hit markers? Damn. And the hard part of the Modern Warfare 2 Mastery Grind, in my opinion, was actually, oh, look at this, AFK. This one. This too. I'm fast as boy. I'm fast. Santa didn't see me. Boy. Hey, did he see me? He did see me. He was going for me. This is an advanced UAV. I'll take it. Let me finish this. Missed. Got him. AFK. Thank you. Is that it? I feel like I've gotten 11. There's no way I haven't, right? Nope. Forge? It's still not here. Okay. The ending challenges for the Orion camo were the ones that made it difficult. Had to get long shots, having to get headshots. You scared me. The challenges for platinum. 
Oh my god. There's Forge. Oh my god. I was like stuttering. I was on a 15 kill streak. Okay. Uh, it's Karambit time. Look at this weapon inspect. I love the fact that they added a Karambit. I wish we could have like a Marble Fade from CSGO or like a Case Hardened Blue Gem. Like, that'd be so cool for a skin. The only difficult part of the Orion camo grind was trying to do like the long shots and doing like the headshots for Polyatomic and everything like that. That was really it. And with an Interstellar, it's gotten even easier. Oh, there's a guy behind me. Okay, that didn't count because he hit me, but that's okay. But yeah, I'm pretty sure one of the challenges for Priceless Camo is get something like five kills, hit firing while moving. That's a challenge. What was he hitting for? Is there somebody over here? Oh, there is. He's AFK. Oh, there's another AFK back here? No way. Okay. Honestly, I would have gotten Interstellar a lot faster than I actually did, but I decided to take this year's grind a little bit, you know, chill and just not play it nearly as much. Got you. Hey, hold this. Three sixty. Hey, hold this. Three sixty. Challenge. Hold it. Hold up. Hold up. Ammo box down. Go. 360 try to snipe me oh my god i ran out that's awkward i'm like actually so confused like are you afk oh no he has his ipad out he's watching my youtube video right now hey yeah that's what you doing right is he watching it again pull it out for a second time yeah, yeah yeah i know you just gotta make sure make sure you drop a like turn on notifications uh subscribe of course one two oh my god Perform three finishing moves on an operator. What else can you perform finishing moves on? Wait, can I finishing move a zombie? Write that down, write that down! I need, I need to remember to execute a zombie if I can. So there's forged for the shotgun. And there's forged for the karambit. So all we need left now is one final weapon, and then we can unlock priceless camo. And like I was saying, look how easy some of these challenges are. The priceless challenge is get 10 kills from behind with a karambit. When you're knifing, that's quite literally all you get is backstabber kills. If we move over to the shotgun, which we just had to get 25 one-shot one kills while ADS scene you only have to get five hit fire kills while moving last up now is our wall bang class we have to get four more penetration kills with the cat amr so initially when i first started going for this challenge i was just kind of playing the game kind of strafing the side of like a wall like bouncing back and forth 24 7 like trying to see somebody come through so then i can time it and like shoot through the wall but i found out coming on war the beginning part is a gold mine for wall bangs did i get the right spot though oh i did i'm in the vehicle yo what's up squad and Look at that, just like my last game. People are just AFK. Like, how do you just spawn into Call of Duty and you're AFK? So this is what I've been doing for wall banks. I go in this little truck right here. I lay right here. This glass is no ordinary glass. This is bulletproof glass, but my bullets will go through it and I'll get kills. So I sit here and I wait until they just spawn. So that's what I'm gonna do because like this is the most sure way of method of getting these type of kills. I don't know if like this part works, but I know this part works. I can't even see anything through this. This is like so hard to see. So now we play the waiting game. I missed. God damn it, man. <laughs> I had one shot and I missed. Maybe right here There's one. Is that a wall bang? It didn't pop up. I really hope it counted. I don't know, man. That's a hit marker. He's going to re-challenge because he got hit marker. There's a guy behind me. I'm not going to move. There's one. Wall bang. It popped up. You see? So yeah, this is the spot that I go to. Another wall bang. There's a Groot skin. I'm dead. Okay. What do I look like? I just look like a bunny on the car. Look at him. <laughs> I know for a fact I got two. So maybe I need two more and just got jump shotted by the Groot. Okay. I'm just making the death run all the way over here. This is like all I was doing when I was leveling up my knives and doing my sniper. All right. Get up here. No one saw me. The Groot skin saw me. Of course he did. Man just can't let a bunny rabbit do his thing in peace. Go, 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 go. Let me get on my truck. All right. Get up here. Go prone here. Did he see me? He didn't see me. I missed. Hit marker. <laughs> Bro, why am I struggling so much? Go prone. Nobody saw me. Wall bang. Is that it? Is that it? No. Is that it? Fall back to the next objective. Okay. I guess that wasn't it. Wait, did it just pop up? And I I just heard it. I heard something pop up. I think I just got robbed. I'm backing out. No. There we go. Okay, we're, we're done. Okay, I did hear it pop up. So now time to do the challenges. So for the cat AMR, we have to get 
three suppressed headshots. You see what I'm talking about when I say easy? Like, there's no way I don't finish this in, like, a day. Spawn to this fresh derail. I got my big behemoth cat AMR sniper. We need three headshots. Let's get it. Ooh, see that guy. He saw me first. <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna keep challenging this guy. Where is he at? Where's this Burger King looking ass dude? I know it's the skin he's rocking. Where is he? He's got there. Wasn't a headshot. Okay. And he left the game immediately. I mean, I would be, I would too. The game's been on now for about a minute and a half, and we're only at six kills. See him right here. There's one, two more to do. That Burger King. There we go. One more. Imagine the wall bang for it. Oh my god. You, I see that. Boom. Headshot. Give me priceless. Yeah! Oh. yeah, that felt good, man. Now we just need 10 hip fire ADS kills. Hip fire ADS kills. Holy f I need to stop speaking. We need 10 kills without aiming. Yeah. Dude, this map is so big that I feel like you could play the entire game and not ever hit score limit. There's one kill. Nine more to go. This guy's AFK. I'll take the free kill. <gasps> What are you doing back here, man? Like, what? There's price. Get five hit fire kills? I thought it was 10. Okay, that's another gun down. Let's see. Can we get 10 backstabber knife kills in one match? I don't know. Find out in the next episode of Dragon Ball Dismo. I mean, probably with how campy this map is, I probably can find 10 people and come behind them. Pause. Oh, hello. There's another backstab kill. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Doesn't even know it. Doesn't even know it. Didn't even know what is coming for him. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. I'm going for him. I'm getting him. I'm getting this Dr. Doom looking ass. Got him. Come here. Got him. Okay, then. Is that me? They just got a healer overwatch. Where is he? Damn. That dude sounds kind of cute. That dude sounds kind of cute. Okay. You just throw that with the Prime Missile. Do it with the Prime Missile. Oh, you are selfish. You did that for one kill. You could have used your entire Prime Missile to take hey, out. Hey, me clout. Hey, me clout. Okay. Oh, no. I'm not trying okay. to do that guy. That had to be some sh man. Man sitting there watching my video, and I'm in the game trying to talk to him. Boom, and there we have it. Our first priceless camo. And if we move over here, we also got it for the shotgun. That is two out of 36 done. How many backstab kills did I get? And I got six kills from behind in one match. I almost got three priceless guns done in one game on probably the slowest map period. And the game went to time limit. Yeah, I'm gonna be able to knock out a lot of this. I kind of want to do another one. Yeah, let's knock out the FAMAS. I need to get 15 operator headshots with a magnification scope. And we have this 4X scope on it. So, yeah. Honestly, after I finish this video, I can see myself just knocking out every single weapon in one night. I think that's what I saw Jeb do. He unlocked Priceless, and the next day he got Interstellar. So, I think I can easily knock all this out, have Interstellar done. And then, I mean, we've beaten the game. And I got Rust. So, I probably will get a lot of headshots done here unless the game's already like started and i'm about to spawn into absolute destruction a few moments later i hear a helicopter i see a helicopter i'm dead i just saw something on twitter that was actually talking about how uh sledgehammer games is actually going to be removing the Groot skin for a little bit because of how overpowered it actually is. They're not removing it like permanently. So if you bought it and like you're afraid that you're getting your skin taken away, you're not, it's gonna come back. I think they're just probably gonna nerf it and make it where it's not so overpowered. Cause at times I literally can't see that stick. That quite literally is a pay to win character model. Okay, and I just can't walk out of my spawn now. I went from having like two really good matches because yeah, I just can't leave my spawn now. I went from having like two really good matches because all I did last night was use the the knife so the spmm was probably a bit lower because you know i was just running at people blindly dying and now i've had two good games where i've been able to do something and now i just can't even leave my spawn it's fine there's one headshot down 14 more to go oh for a second i thought this guy had interstellar it's just what is this camera hold up no i was trying to okay what is my butt my guy's <laughs> My guy's foot was stuck in the metal, like, little pipes or whatever. That was funny. I wonder if I go semi-auto and I go hide right up here. No one's gonna know. Okay. He knew. I can't leave my spawn. Holy fuck. Another headshot, and I'm dead. It's... Okay. Oh, my God. We really can't. This guy's on a five kill streak. I didn't even see him. Where... Okay. 
Bro, can I walk out of the spawn? Bro, I'm pulling my trigger. Finally. Bro, it's like I gotta die 16 times just to get one kill. There we go. I'm going prone right here. I'm just gonna wait. I already know someone's gonna challenge this. I got the Groot. Never mind. Groot's getting dead next to me. That's a headshot. That's not a headshot, but I'll do this real quick. A little parkour strat. Parkour! Go, go, go. They're never gonna know. They're never gonna know. Yeah, if you guys didn't know that, that's how you can get up here like really, really quick so you don't have to run around the entire map. That's a headshot. I can't walk out of my spawn, so this is what I've resorted to. Headshot. I lost count. Uh, got him. Nope. This is extremely ratty. Extremely campy. Are you Dismo? Yes. Let's see what he has to say. How have I not gotten a headshot yet? There we go. Bro, are these guys just not gonna leave? There's no way that's how I die. I think I was like on a 15 kill streak. Oh, that was actually so funny. Headshot. At least it confirms you don't use VPN. I drop like a nuke like once every like, I don't know how many months. Got him. Got him. Spawn over here. More. Got him. Quad head. Quad head. They're gonna spawn this way. I'm waiting. Missed. Turn around. Woo! We got it. This is actually such an easy challenge, especially in hardcore. And there's priceless unlocked. Okay. Bro, this camo looks so beautiful, man. So yeah, here is priceless camo. This gives me like diamond vibes. I don't know if you guys remember Infinite Warfare had like a weird looking diamond when the game first came out. And this is like the vibes that I get from it. I really like this. Like this could be the mastery camo and I would have been okay. Like the fact that we also have another cool camo like Interstellar and not to mention we have Borealis, Serpentine and a lot of other things. This is such a clean looking camo. Yo, Bravo, bravo sledgehammer. So much better than polyatomic. So yeah, that is priceless camo in Modern Warfare 3. Honestly, probably the easiest challenges I've ever had to do for a camo grind. I'll probably spend the rest of the day knocking out the rest of these guns and unlock Interstellar and that will be it. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, drop a like if you guys did. Subscribe if you guys are brand new. And if you made it to this part of the video, I hope you have a fantastic day. Peace.